What the hell? What the hell? Are those baked bugs? Hey buds, it's Treasure Wolf, and today we are playing Loveland. Now, if you're not familiar with cryptid lore, Loveland refers to the Loveland Frog, or the Loveland Frogman, who was a creature in, I think it was like a, the county of Loveland, and it looked like a, a big frog on its hind legs. This is a demo for a horror game called Loveland about a cult that is worshipping the frogs, I think. Loveland, Ohio. There you go. 1991. A little, little loud. Yeah. Finally, a demo where you can easily change the volume. For the last couple of months, there have been several missing persons reported out of Loveland, Ohio. Uh, yo -o. Initially, we had very little to go on until about one week ago. Mr. Buchanan, a resident of a small trailer park on the outskirts of town, contacted the Loveland authorities to report strange happenings from within the park. Strange happenings, He claimed okay. that the other members of the community had begun worshipping frogs and have formed mm -hmm. a cult whilst also kidnapping the local townsfolk. We are dispatching you to investigate these reports and determine exactly oh, I what see it those is we are dealing with. Okay. Good luck, detective. We know you'll need it. Well, that's not very, um, reassuring. My flashlight is the only piece of equipment the agency lets us bring. What? Oh my god, the agency. Is this like a cryptid hunting agency? Uh, eight days ago, agency communications operatives, ACO, intercepted a phone call between the Loveland Police Department. Mr. Buchanan, uh, a resident of a small trailer park in the outskirts of town known as Loveland Cove, was contacting local authorities to report cult-like behavior. He resides in trailer number 102, indicated the residents have begun worshipping a new species of frog that has emerged from the lake led to the residents committing various atrocities, including but not limited to abduction and homicide. You've been dispatched out to the area to investigate these reports and determine if anomalous activities have occurred. You are to operate in complete secrecy. Do not divulge any information that may compromise you or the agency. Okay. My mapping kit. Okay. Is there any... Wait, what was that? Is there... My agency ID. Shouldn't go with waving this around unless absolutely necessary. Loveland Cove. Well, here we... I need to up the sensitivity. Oh, much better. Okay. Games always have it way not sensitive enough. I need... I need sensitivity. I need appreciation. Look at that. That low poly beast. Hello? Oh my god, that thing is amazing. The full game, I don't know when it's releasing, but uh, sometime after I play this. I should start by checking out a Mr. Buchanan trailer number 102. No answer, but it's unlocked. Oh no. Oh no, I don't, I don't know if I should just go wandering around in here. Five more missing in Loveland, including the 18-year-old daughter of the newly appointed minister of the Heartland Church. Total people who have vanished is eight. Well, that's no good. Oh, God. Why am I doing this? Why am I going in here? Pick up crickets and mealworms from the bait shop. Feed children... Feed them with the crickets and mealworms? Check in on Jeremiah, traitorous bastard. Jeremiah, you know you know what they say about Jeremiah? He was a bullfrog. Change out the jugs and the stills. Bathe in his glory. Well. Sounds cool. Did that say oops all bones? <laughs> oh man, oops all bones. XXX frog whiskey. You be eating frog whiskey? Frog shine? Moonshine mixed with frogs. Oh, that's horrible. That's so nasty. Oh, no, I can't get out of here. Uh. 
Okay. I shouldn't have gone in there, should I? I'm gonna check around some other places before I go into 102, just to see what else there is to see. And I am always a big fan of... Yeah, who is it? I'm a detective with... Oh, I get to choose. I'm a detective with the agency. I got a few questions for you. The main game is supposed to have multiple endings. Agency? What, is hell, what the hell is that? You working for the CIA? I don't know if you can see my little mouse keeps spinning. I, I hope that's not super annoying. Uh, I don't think I should... Forget I said anything. Are you willing to answer a few questions? Hell no, I'm not going to answer questions for some kind of government spook. Oh, uh, well... Well, that's not the most helpful thing. Oh man, I feel like even in the demo there's multiple things that I can do. This is cool. This is cool. Oh, I'm jumping about. I'm like a little frog. This is really cool, actually. And I just, I love me some cryptids. I love me some cryptids. And the Loveland frog is a very underappreciated cryptid. Not a lot of people know about it. What's this? I look upon the lake and know that my time is drawing near. I should be overjoyed, but all I feel is disappointment. I thought Thomas would be proud that the Lord chose me as a vessel for his children. Instead, he raised his voice in anger that could be matched only by the fiery pits of hell. But what was I to do? Deny the Lord his children? I couldn't do that, so here I wait alone. I don't want to think too deeply on what that could mean, because, um, yeah, I'm just not going to go into that one. I'm the perfect vessel. I hear them whispering to me. I feel them inside of me. I tell my love soon that I will be fried. Uh, I think someone is having frog babies. Love of them, they have like intractable sinks and toilets even when it doesn't do anything. Piece of medallion. Thomas is the most enchanting man I've ever met. As the Lord speaks through him, I can't help but hang on his every word. He says the Lord speaks of a second great flood that will come to wash away the wickedness of the world. If we devote ourselves to the Lord, he will shed us of our current bodies and mold us into his form. Uh, Thomas is the Messiah. I don't trust anyone who claims to be a messiah. What the hell is going on? Hello? Um. Oh no. Okay, this place got wrecked. Something happening out on the lake. Oh yeah, there is. Let me go to 102. Let me go to 102 before I go any further. I should have just gone up to 102 in the first place. Okay, it's really cool that it seems like even the demo has multiple different scenarios in it, you know? The heathen Jeremiah went to the cops. Gather the flock. We need to be ready in case they come around sniffing where they shouldn't. As for Jeremiah, find him, bring him to me. The Lord has special ways of dealing with a Judas. Oh no. They're gonna sacrifice him. I bet there's like secret TV stations you can find. When the frogs first showed up, I thought they were harmless. Hell, maybe even a little cute. Boy, was I wrong. Just touching one sense you flying higher than a kite. Not only that, you feel the strong connection. Almost like God himself is calling out to you. It wasn't long before Pastor Abram was holding up the frogs, declaring them our savior, and everyone believes him. Now people from town are showing up as missing. So Jeremiah, is that the person that I was supposed to meet? Frog repellent. One part lemon juice, one part vinegar. Mix in a pot, bring to the boil, pour into spray bottle. Need to find some lemon juice. That's white vinegar. And that's lemon juice. Okay, I'm boiling it up. So I think they got to my informant. If I had gone here right away, would they have not got here in time? Okay, I can spray it. Oh. 
Oh, he does not like that. Okay. It's electrical conduit. Controls all the power. Yeah, I can already tell that if this was made into like a full-size game, there would be so much to do. It'd actually be really cool. Hello? Like all the different like investigating and talking to different people and stuff and the different like if you maintain a, a lower profile or make it more obvious what you're doing. My little boy Timmy is finally ready for the end of days. I won't lie, I didn't trust Abram at first. Forcing a child to drink alcohol, it seemed like madness, but he kept insisting he drink the frog shine. And when you know it, it worked. Timmy's taken on the Lord's form and is ready to serve the Great Flood. Thank you, Pastor Abram. Yeah, there's gotta be some secrets with the TV there. There's gotta be. Oh, ho, ho. Got a screwdriver. Always, always useful. Is there anything else? Should be able to unlock it with the screwdriver. Okay, cool. Another part of the medallion. Ooh. It's looking a little froggy in here. <laughs> Buddy's going crazy. Is there anything else in here? Nothing more sobering than a cold shower. Well, that's not the most helpful thing in the world. Why did I go in here? Oh, I guess the medallion. Okay. I don't know what the medallion is for, but I guess I'm going to keep investigating houses. This is actually so fun. It's locked. I wonder if there's a key around. Oh, well, right, right there. Okay, that's easy. Easy enough. Key broke off in the lock. Okay. Mixing the moonshine and the frog snot was a stroke of gene. Oh, gross. The f alcohol cuts back in the psychedelic effects, letting us stay connected to the Lord, but being able to walk and talk. I've been sneaking it to people at the bar I work at. You can always tell when it hits them. You see the Lord's love in their eyes. Oh, no. I don't know what you're cooking there, but I don't like it. Oh, it tasted awful, but it feels so good. Oh, no. Did I take some of the frog shine? Oh god. Oh god, is there an ending where I just drink all the frog shine? Okay, I drank a bunch of the frog shine. I don't think that's good for me. Yeah, I'm gonna die, but that's fine. Oh. Call True Believer Radio. You've reached Speaker John on True Believer Radio. Tell me, caller, do you have an experience to turn you into a true believer that you'd like to share with us? Is Ivana there? What? What's the lore here? I'm sorry, Ivana? Ivana who? Ivana Hump. <laughs> you got me. You got me. Uh, yeah, you got me. Who should I call? What if I call the agency? Thank you for calling the agency hotline. Please enter your agency badge ID. Enter badge ID. Thank you, detective. Please choose one of the following menu options. Press one for detective tips, two for vulnerable support, three for hang up. Detective tips. You've chosen detective tips. Uh, gather evidence. Okay. Leave no trace of your presence. Oh, God, do not mention the agency. Well, I wish I knew that in the first place. I'm just going to die of frog shine. I don't know if it's doing anything else. I don't know if I can die of frog shine. So if I was, you know, playing the actual game, I feel like it would be really important to, like, do I follow what the agency says? Do I do my own thing? Looks like that's where they make the frog shine. Board it up. A crowbar would be helpful right about now. I don't see a crowbar anywhere. Okay. I thought the, the frog shine was going to kill me. I kind of wish it didn't. And this has such good atmosphere. And you know I love me a pixelated horror game. Ooh, they keep in all sorts of bugs. I can't turn it off. Covered in some kind of goop. Maybe I should clean it off before taking it. No? Probably should have cleaned that off first. Why? 
What happened? What is happening? The Lord has blessed us with a gift from heaven. We must tend to the Lord's children to love and embrace them. He promises to bless us with a new form that can withstand 40 days and 40 nights of torrential rain. We toil in his garden, feeding and breeding, cultivating this gift. The local heathens taint it, the dilute it, poisoning it, muddying his word. These sinners will never truly be saved. Why? Why the loud noise? So, there's a f they believe there's a flood, and by turning themselves into frogs, they can survive the flood. Which doesn't seem like the smartest way of doing that. I would say build a boat. It worked before. So I think I've been in all the houses at this point. So, how do I go out of the fence here? Looks like I need some sort of medallion to unlock the gate. Gate needs power. Okay. It was right here. Oh, good thing I got the fuse. Alright. Good stuff. Let's go, baby. Okay. This must be Abram's trailer. I don't remember who Abram is, I'm sorry. Oh god. Hello? No answer. Not surprising, better have a look inside. The walls are covered in hand-painted portraits of Jesus. Well, I mean, people do be liking that guy. Unlabeled VHS tape. Can I... Can I play it? It's padlocked. Oh, this looks rather nice here. The Lord has spoken to me. He did lament to the defilement of his name and spoke of a corruption that permeates all of it. Oh, Abram is the, the high priest. A thick fog that dims all that is holy. He told me of his plan to flood, flood the earth. Uh, he has chosen me as he did Noah. I must lead his flock to salvation. Okay, the book of Genesis. Okay. You you know that, right? Maybe? I took a religion course in college, so I learned about Christianity. I didn't grow up with any sort of religion. We just, you know, we lived in the swamp. So, don't need religion in the swamp. Just need some good, good boots. Did I see the... I keep seeing these, like, violet eyes out there. They welded the door shut with chains. Okay, they're growing their frog weed. Ah, break open the door in trailer 104. Blessed us with a bountiful harvest. With this wheat and corn, we can produce a ton of frog shine. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So I can go back to trailer 104. Those are graves. Ah, it doesn't bode well for me. I seem to have mostly recovered from the frog shine. Oh, God. Hello? It's Mr. Buchanan. He seems to be in some kind of trance. Oh, what is this? Knows best? Who knows best? Obey? Him? Oh. That's like some sort of brainwashing tape. It's hypnotic. Mr. Buchanan, thank you. Oh, you're welcome, my guy. Thank you for turning that off. They've been starving me. I almost gave in. The game seems to have frozen. Who are you? Oh, I'm with the... Doesn't matter who I am. I shouldn't talk about the agency. Whatever. Listen, you need to find the caves. Abram has taken them there. Be careful. They're waiting. Okay. Okay, it's unfrozen. Cool. We passed out from hunger. I wonder if there's any food not doused in frog shine around. What does that say? Croak? Let him inside? The chorus sings. Hello? Good evening, agent. Huh? That's what you are, right? Some kind of... Oh, that it's that guy. That's what you are, right? Some kind of government spook. I see you found Jeremiah. He strayed a little too far from the Lord's light. You must be Abram. 
It must be Thomas Abram, ex-pastor at Heartland Church of Christ. I see my reputation precedes me. That's to be expected for a man of my importance. It would do you well to leave this land and let us worship in peace. You are turning people into frogs, my dude. Absolutely not. You expect me to sweep the kidnappings under the rug? That is not an option. You tell him, detective. You can come quietly or we can have a strike team drag you and your flock out. Hell yeah. The government has no merit dictating how we practice our religion. This is the thing. Like, yes, but only if you're not hurting people. You will regret those words. God himself will see to it. Um, carrot soup. That might help Mr. Buchanan think. A bowl. Perfect for serving soup in. Oh, hello, Mr. B Is he attached to that chair? Is he, like, imprisoned here? What should I do? Give him a bowl of carrot soup. He's starving. Some carrot soup should do the trick. That sounds kind of good, actually. Oh, God, what did you feed me? Um, my insides are in fire. Wait, it was just carrot soup. I can't even... Damn it, he's completely out of it. He's useless to me like that. What the hell was in that soup? Oh, no. I'm sorry, my guy. What the hell? What the hell? Are those baked bugs? You baking some bugs, my guy? Call Timmy Tom's Pizza Bomberia. You got Timmy Tom's Pizza Bomberia. What kind of pie you want to try? Ooh, Hawaiian, my guy. I'd like to order a Hawaiian pizza, please. Gross. Got it. <laughs> no, Hawaiian is great. You call it thumbs up to five ninety. Who has pizza for five ninety nine? Oh my god! Delivered something in the next ten minutes. If not, the pizza is free. Pizza, pasta. Put it in a box. Yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm missing here. Oh. I don't even notice that's actually killing them. Oh man, okay. Grody. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Pizza place. Pizza plate. Pizza truck. Sounds like my pizza. Oh god, what is wrong with you, buddy? Be $5.99 for the pizza. Keep the change. Thanks, dude. Smell you later. <laughs> Timmy Tom's Pizza Bomberia. Hawaiian pizza. Some people hate it, but they are missing out. I. I'm an enjoyer of his Hawaiian pizza. That's just like pineapple and ham on pizza. That's great, dude. Pineapple is amazing on pizza. If you don't like that, then you are a perfectly valid person with your own personal tastes. Ah, oh, man, did I mess this up? I totally messed it up by feeding him the carrots. Ah, oh, crap. Maybe there's something else I missed in the pastor's house. Oh, no. More frog shine. I'm gonna drink that stuff down. There we go. Okay. I am so dumb for missing that. Okay. What's this now? Surveillance equipment. Play VHS tapes. Wait, why did it not let me play the VHS tapes? Why couldn't I play the VHS tapes? So Oh, the agency, September 20th, 1991. Interrogation, Ouroboros. Detective debriefing. Into the room we go. Hello? Hello? Good evening, detective. Hello? Hi. We hope your investigation was a success. Yeah. Please have a seat. Okay. Thank you, detective. Now, our line of work is very dangerous. Okay. Especially to those with a weak mind. Okay. To combat this, we employ the use of sodium pentothal. Think of it as a kind of truth-telling serum. Uh-oh. Now, detective, please take the pill on the desk, place it into your mouth, and then swallow it. Okay. I don't trust like this. What? Okay. 
So probably it was a little confusing at the end because there will be more expansions to that. So when the full game comes out, presumably there will be more tapes to watch in that room. You'll actually see the frog people, talk to the agency. Your choices will matter. There's multiple endings. This was so cool. I absolutely love this demo. I will totally play the regular, the full game when it comes out. If you want to wishlist it, there will be a link in the description for that and also to play the demo yourself. Ah, oh, man, that was just so cool. I love the idea of taking a cryptid and kind of making a whole game around it. And this was just, felt like it had a lot of choice and the graphics were cool and just like a really fun, really fun concept. I love that. I hope you enjoyed it as well. If you want to watch me play some other funky little horror games, there will be links in the description below. And if you enjoyed my video, please feel free to like, comment, or even subscribe to my channel because my little heart's so good. Mwah. Love you so much. And until next time, why don't you look up Loveland Frogman or any other cryptid that strikes your fancy because I think they are fascinating. See you then. Ch Ching.